Let's make an easy beef chow fun that's better than takeout. First, let's make the stir fry sauce. Here I have 1 3rd cup beef stock to which I'll add 1 tablespoon soy sauce, 1 tablespoon cooking wine, 1 tablespoon oyster sauce, half tablespoon sweet soy sauce, or 1 teaspoon sugar, and 1 teaspoon white vinegar. To make the marinade, in another medium bowl, combine 2 tablespoons soy sauce, 1 tablespoon cooking wine, 1 and a half teaspoon cornstarch, and a half teaspoon of baking soda. To make the slurry, I rehydrated some dried shiitakes and I'm combining two teaspoons of the liquid to two teaspoons of cornstarch. For the beef, this dish is best made with flank or skirt steak. Start by patting the steak dry. Note the direction of the grain. I'll cut the meat in half and then thinly slice the steak against the grain. This will make it more tender. Slicing it with the grain will end up being tough and chewy. If you're enjoying this video, please thumbs up and subscribe. Add the steak to the marinade and massage it in. Set aside while you prep the rest of the ingredients. I'm going to cut about a third a large white onion into wedges. I'll slice up a couple green onions to add at the end of cooking. Here I'm using Chinese broccoli or gai lan for the greens. I didn't really measure, this is just a couple handfuls. You can use bok choy or green pepper or skip the greens altogether. I'll just trim the ends and set them aside. Now for the hard part, the fresh rice noodles. You can find these in the refrigerated section of an Asian grocery store, usually near the dumpling wrappers. These are difficult to work with, so be patient. Gently break a large piece apart. It's hard to describe, but you'll feel it. Microwave the noodles for 20 to 30 seconds and then gently separate them. If needed, microwave again for 10 seconds and continue until they're all separated. If you want to go the easier method, use these dry Taiwanese sliced noodles instead. I use about two pucks per serving. With a large pan or wok over medium high heat, add some neutral cooking oil. Once the oil is hot, add the meat, spread it out, and sear for 30 seconds. Then add the onions and stir for about two minutes. Ensure the onions make contact with the pan to get some nice browning. Turn over any meat strips that are red. Add the noodles and stir for a couple minutes, letting the noodles get a bit of a sear. Add the greens and let them wilt down. Add the stir fry sauce and mix in. Turn the heat up if necessary as the stir fry sauce can cool the pan. Traditionally, this dish uses bean sprouts, but I don't like their texture with the noodles, so I skip them. After a couple minutes, add the slurry and combine everything. Let it cook for another minute to thicken, then add the green onions, and then you're done. The noodles broke, but that doesn't make this dish any less delicious. I like the big chunks of onion. It's nice against the sweet and saltiness of the stir-fry sauce. Thank you for watching. Please thumbs up and subscribe.